Microsoft Excel and Microsoft Power BI are the most popular and used tools for analyzing and visualizing data. But Microsoft Excel is not created for gathering data, especially in gathering relational data like master detail structures. One basic, simple example. You want to gather or track orders and then for these orders you want to track order details and, for example, order payments. Not to mention to do this in a multi-user environment. Boy, you will have a tough time to do this in Excel. Because Excel is simply not created for challenges like this to gather master detail data and also in a multi-user environment. But in this course, you will learn how you can do this by using Excel and VBA as a front-end and MySQL database as a back-end. Whether the MySQL database is on your local machine, your local network or on the web server and then you can connect to this data from Excel and use it. We will do this with help of a small tool called Virtual Forms. Hello, I'm Davor Getsi, the CEO and the lead developer of Wimpis, the company that's behind a popular tool that brings to Excel what Access developers are having for decades. It is the ability to create crude forms, forms to create, read, update and delete records that are stored in a database like MySQL, Microsoft SQL Server, Access, on Promise and on the web. And all that in minutes. It is similar to what Access can do, but you could also transform these virtual forms from Excel VBA to Visual Studio 2017, C Sharp or VB.net. You cannot do this with Access. So, you just need to create a database and tell the designer which fields you want on your form. Once created, virtual forms can be also used as a lookup forms in Excel VBA with no extra work. All the controls that are generated on these virtual forms can be accessed with VBA or if you use Visual Studio 2017 with C Sharp or VB.net. Virtual Form Control also fires events, so it allows us to interact with it in a similar way normal user forms in Excel VBA do, but in a more data-centric way. Before you dive in, it's probably a good idea to just check out the structure of the course. So in this course, you will learn how to quickly create database applications using Microsoft Excel, VBA and a MySQL database that is hosted somewhere on the internet or in your building, so-called on-premise, and all that with help of a small tool called Virtual Forms. In the first part of this course, you will learn how to create your first database app that will use Excel and VBA as a front-end and the MySQL database as the back-end. You will also learn how to install a MySQL server on your machine or anywhere in your network and use it as a data source. Also, in the first part of this course, you will learn how to install and use MySQL Workbench that help us to create and maintain MySQL databases. Don't worry, I will go slow. After that, you will learn how you can, with just a few lines of Excel VBA code, connect to MySQL database and to Virtual Form Control and Virtual Form Designer. Not only you will learn how to create your Excel virtual forms and write a few lines of VBA code to master them, you will also learn how you can make money with them by leveraging an affiliate program for a third-party web hosting company where you will host MySQL database. And then you will also learn how to transform your Excel VBA database applications with MySQL database as the data source to C Sharp or VB.net with almost no change to the VBA code. If you ever get stuck with something in the course, just post a message 
in the Q&A of this course and I will respond as soon as I can to help you out. I do everything I can to make this a 5 star course and I hope you like it too and leave a review. Feel free to take a look at preview lectures and the course description before making a decision to buy. And yes, this course is covered with 100% 30-day money-back guarantee. You don't have anything to lose. So, enroll now, try it out, learn new things, have fun with me and create your Microsoft Excel apps in minutes. Join me inside.